the most important Sun Devils players on the defense. We're going to move to the interior of the defensive line. There are some very talented players here. You've got Justin Wadley, who is coming in from Cincinnati. Uh, Jacob Rich Kangaika is coming in from Arizona. There are some youngsters on this team. But to me, the most important guy is CJ Fight. And with Fight, this is a, a big SOB. Like, <laughs> this is the dude that you line up on offense and you go, ah, crap, I got to play him for 60 minutes. He's big, he's strong, he's physical, and he's been working to become a better pass rusher. But to me, fight's importance is going to go beyond the box score. First of all, Anthony Cooper, one of the veteran leading defenders on the team, regardless of position, tore his ACL earlier in spring ball. And he is going to be out for probably most, if not all, of the 2024 season. He was expected to play along the defensive interior and maybe bounce outside to edge rusher. He was a veteran. He was a guy that Arizona State has really valued his presence over the last several years. He's gone. So now looking at the defensive line, there's players for sure, but there's not a lot of guys who have a ton of game time experience and there's nobody who has the amount of Sun Devils experience that CJ Fight has. Excuse me. He's a very talented player. This is this is a this is a guy that I anticipate is going to have a breakout season. He came to Arizona State last year, was able to get his way onto the football field. He was able to stay healthy. He was able to be a consistent player. He anchors the line. He does a little bit of everything that you're looking for as a freshman. Now going into his sophomore year, you're hoping that he's going to be able to build upon those strengths. You hope that he can continue to become that anchor of the defensive line, be somebody that is going to dictate the pace of the game through the trenches. It's going to be a lot of pressure on CJ Fight. You also wonder whether or not the experience he has as a starting defensive tackle, even as a true sophomore, is going to lead him to potentially a veteran role for the team. I don't know. I wouldn't anticipate it simply because I don't think that's a fair expectation to give to a true sophomore player. But this is somebody that the team has held in very high esteem. And CJ Fight is somebody that they clearly have a a very big interest in getting him onto the football field, somebody that they, they really like. I would not be surprised if CJ Fight was one of the most important players on the defensive front, not just the interior, but the edge as well. A lot is going to come down to him. And he could have some help from Wadley, from Kongaika, from Tristan Monday or anybody else along the defensive interior. There's there's guys there to help out. I just look at CJ Fight and I'm like, yeah, there's there's going to be a little bit of pressure there for you to play at a very high level, even as a true sophomore, right, wrong, or indifferent. I think he's up to the challenge. I think this is a this is a cornerstone player for you, but this is going to be a big year for CJ Fight. He is one of the most important players. Now, at the top of the show, I mentioned I could not narrow it down to one player, and instead I have a position listed, and that would be